A Colorado woman gets a century behind bars for one of the most unthinkable crimes. It all started with a fake pregnancy and ended with her cutting another woman to steal her unborn child. Denver 7's Russell Haythorn was at today's sentencing, and Russell Michelle Wilkins was there to see her attacker sentenced. She was in the courtroom today, and this case was so distressing on so many levels, it went all the way to the state capitol last year, forcing lawmakers to take up the issue of unborn children and murder charges. Ultimately, that bill did not pass, but today the victim said both society and justice responded appropriately. Judge Maria Birkencotter, stern and commanding on behalf of the victims. People are hungry to hear from Ms. Lane to hear why you did this, hungry to desperate to hear you explain what happened to Aurora. Birkin Cotter sentenced Dinell Lane to 100 years in prison for faking her own pregnancy, then luring Michelle Wilkins into her home and cutting Wilkins' almost full-term baby out of her womb. I've never seen a case as vicious, as cruel, as deliberate. Uh, and as awful as this case. Because of Colorado laws, the majority of charges in this case were related to Wilkins injuries, not the harm inflicted on the unborn child. So Wilkins wanted the sentencing phase to be about her daughter, Aurora, even displaying a large photo of Aurora in court. We didn't want her, as my father so eloquently said, not to have her day in court. Wilkins called her attacker a narcissistic liar who only cried in court out of self-pity when her own family begged the judge for leniency. The most emotional that I saw her was when the letter from her daughter was being read. And it occurs to me and didn't escape Judge Birkencotter's notice either that those are all the things that I didn't get to have with Aurora because of Dinell. Another telling comment from the judge today. She said, quote, there's always been the question of whether Miss Lane killed Michelle and tried to take Aurora because she wanted a baby or merely because she wanted proof that she was pregnant. The judge said those are two very different things. Those are two profoundly disturbing things. Again, Dinell Lane will spend 100 years behind bars. We're live tonight. Russell Haythorn, Denver 7. Thank you, Russell.